the experiment that we're doing this afternoon. Half of you are going to have a water drink. Half of you are going to have a sports drink that we've made up. Put your hands up if you think people drinking the water is going to run the fastest. Put your hands up if you think the people drinking the sports drink are going to run the fastest. Now, what we have to do is calculate an average time per group. So you need to add all of those up, divide your number that you get by 19, and that will give you your average. Hands up, which do you think group A were, and which do you think group B were? Sports drink was group A, water was group B. The fact that the RSC have devised and developed this experiment already um, has been hugely successful for us because it would take us a long time as a school to create something that big. Um, and the fact that they have done it in time for the Olympics is great because already that excitement for the Olympics is building up. Um, so to now be able to connect science with sport is, is an excellent opportunity for the children. I think it's really important for the children that they see that learning has a purpose and we believe that very strongly and we think that experiential learning and first-hand experience is the way that children learn the very best. It was just a perfect opportunity for them to learn so much within a very short space of time. Something um, like what they've learned today could have taken two or three lessons for them to get the same message across but by doing it in one afternoon um, it raised the excitement levels right up and um, they were able to learn something very very quickly um, by putting it into practice and the children are very excited to be looking back on the website in the next couple of weeks to check when other schools have uploaded their results so we can see if we've all come to the same conclusion.